Poseidon, Greek, Poseidon pronounced pose dn, was one of the twelve Olympians in ancient Greek religion and myth, god of the sea, storms, earthquakes and horses. In pre-Olympian Bronze Age Greece, he was venerated as a chief deity at Pylos and Thebes. His Roman equivalent is Neptune. Poseidon was protector of seafarers, and of many Hellenic cities and colonies. In Homer's Iliad, Poseidon supports the Greeks against the Trojans during the Trojan War and in the Odyssey, during the sea voyage from Troy back home to Ithaca, the Greek hero Odysseus provokes Poseidon's fury by blinding his son, the Cyclops Polyphemus, resulting in Poseidon punishing him with storms, the complete loss of his ship and companions, and a ten-year delay. Poseidon is also the subject of a Homeric hymn. In Plato's Timaeus and Critias, the island of Atlantis was Poseidon's domain. Topic: <inaudible> Etymology. <inaudible> <inaudible> the earliest attested occurrence of the name, written in Linear B, is Po Se Da O or Po Se Da Wo Ne, which correspond to Poseidon, Poseidon and Poseidonos, Poseidonos in Mycenaean Greek, in Homeric Greek it appears as Poseidon, Poseidon in Aeolic as Potidaean, Potidaean, and in Doric as Potidon, Potidon, Potidaean, Potidaean, and Potatus, Potatus. The form Potidaean, Potidawan appears in Corinth. The origins of the name Poseidon are unclear. One theory breaks it down into an element meaning husband or lord. Greek posis, posis from pi asterisk potes and another element meaning earth. Da da, Doric for gi, gi, producing something like lord or spouse of da, i.e. of the earth. This would link him with Demeter, earth mother. Walter Burkert finds that the second element da remains hopelessly ambiguous and finds a husband of earth reading quite impossible to prove another theory interprets the second element as related to the word asterisk daon dawan water this would make asterisk pose dawan into the master of waters there is also the possibility that the word has pre-greek origin Plato in his dialogue Cratylus gives two alternative etymologies, either the sea restrained Poseidon when walking as a foot bond, Poseidsman or he knew many things, Poia Idotos or Poia Iden, at least a few sources deem Poseidon as a prehellenic, i.e. Pelasgian word, considering an Indo-European etymology, quite pointless. Topic. Epithets Common epithets or adjectives applied to Poseidon are Enosithon, Enosithon earth shaker, or earth shaking, and Enosigios, Enosigios used by Homer in the Iliad and by Nonus in Dionysiaca. Of the two phrases, Enosithon has an older evidence of use, as it is identified in Linear B, as, e ne si da o ne. The epithets Enosigios and Enosidas indicate the thonic nature of Poseidon, that is to say, Poseidon was regarded as holding sway over land as well as the sea. Another epithet of Poseidon was, dark haired. Kinachet. Topic: Bronze Age Greece. Topic: Linear B, Mycenaean Greek inscriptions. If surviving Linear B clay tablets can be trusted, the name Po Se Da Wo Ne. Poseidon occurs with greater frequency than does du ya Zeus. A feminine variant, Po se de Ia, is also found, indicating a lost consort goddess, in effect the precursor of Amphitrite. Poseidon carries frequently the title Wa na ka in Linear B inscriptions, as king of the underworld. 
The thonic nature of Poseidon Wanix is also indicated by his title e ne si da o ne in Mycenaean Gnosis and Pylos, a powerful attribute earthquakes had accompanied the collapse of the Minoan palace culture. In the cave of Amnisos, Crete Inesidaean is related with the cult of Elethia, the goddess of childbirth. She was related with the annual birth of the divine child. During the Bronze Age, a goddess of nature, dominated both in Minoan and Mycenaean cult, and Wanix was her male companion in Mycenaean cult. It is possible that Demeter appears as Da Mate in a linear B inscription PNN 609, however the interpretation is still under dispute, in linear B inscriptions found at Pylos, E ne si da o ne is related with Poseidon, and si to po tini ya is probably related with Demeter. Tablets from Pylos record sacrificial goods destined for the two queens and Poseidon. To the two queens and the king. Wa na soi, wa na ka te. The two queens may be related with Demeter and Persephone, or their precursors, goddesses who were not associated with Poseidon in later periods. Topic: <laughs> Arcadian myths. The illuminating exception is the archaic and localized myth of the stallion Poseidon and Mare Demeter at Phigalia in isolated and conservative Arcadia, noted by Pausanias second century AD as having fallen into desuetude. The stallion Poseidon pursues the Mare Demeter, and from the union she bears the horse Arian, and a daughter, Despoina, who obviously had the shape of a mare too. The violated Demeter was Demeter Aranus Furious. In Arcadia, Demeter's mare form was worshipped into historical times. Her zoanon of Figalea shows how the local cult interpreted her, as goddess of nature. A Medusa type with a horse's head with snaky hair, holding a dove and a dolphin, probably representing her power over air and water. <laughs> Topic. Origins. It seems that the Arcadian myth is related with the first Greek-speaking people who entered the region during the Bronze Age. Linear B represents an archaic Greek dialect. Their religious beliefs were mixed with the beliefs of the indigenous population. It is possible that the Greeks did not bring with them other gods except Zeus, Eos, and the Dioscoroi. The horse Numina was related with the liquid element, and with the underworld. Poseidon appears as a beast horse, which is the river spirit of the underworld, as it usually happens in northern European folklore, and not unusually in Greece. Poseidon, Wanix, is the male companion Peredros, of the goddess of nature. In the relative Minoan myth, Pasiphae is mating with the white bull, and she bears the hybrid creature Minotaur. The bull was the old pre-Olympian Poseidon. The goddess of nature and her Peredros survived in the Eleusinian cult, where the following words were uttered, Mighty Potnia bore a strong son. In the heavily sea-dependent Mycenaean culture, there is not sufficient evidence that Poseidon was connected with the sea. We do not know if Posdea was a sea goddess. Homer and Hesiod suggest that Poseidon became lord of the sea following the defeat of his father Cronos, when the world was divided by lot among his three sons, Zeus was given the sky, Hades the underworld, and Poseidon the sea, with the earth and Mount Olympus belonging to all three. Given Poseidon's connection with horses as well as the sea, and the landlocked situation of the likely Indo-European homeland, Nobuo Komida has proposed that Poseidon was originally an aristocratic Indo-European horse god who was then assimilated to Near Eastern aquatic deities when the basis of the Greek livelihood shifted from the land to the sea, or a god of fresh waters who was assigned a secondary role as god of the sea, where he overwhelmed the original Aegean sea deity such as Proteus and Nerus. 
Conversely, Walter Burkert suggests that the Hellene cult worship of Poseidon as a horse god may be connected to the introduction of the horse and war chariot from Anatolia to Greece around 1600 BC. It is almost sure that once Poseidon was worshipped as a horse, and this is evident by his cult in Peloponnesos. However, he was originally a god of the waters, and therefore he became the earth shaker. Because the Greeks believed that the cause of the earthquakes was the erosion of the rocks by the waters, by the rivers who they saw to disappear into the earth and then to burst out again. This is what the natural philosophers Thales, Anaximenes and Aristotle believed, which could not be different from the folklore belief. Later, when the Mycenaeans travelled along the sea, he was assigned a role as god of the sea. In any case, the early importance of Poseidon can still be glimpsed in Homer's Odyssey, where Poseidon rather than Zeus is the major mover of events. In Homer, Poseidon is the master of the sea. Topic. Worship of Poseidon Poseidon was a major civic god of several cities. In Athens, he was second only to Athena in importance, while in Corinth and many cities of Magna Graecia, he was the chief god of the polis. In his benign aspect, Poseidon was seen as creating new islands and offering calm seas. When offended or ignored, he supposedly struck the ground with his trident and caused chaotic springs, earthquakes, drownings, and shipwrecks. Sailors prayed to Poseidon for a safe voyage, sometimes drowning horses as a sacrifice. In this way, according to a fragmentary papyrus, Alexander the Great paused at the Syrian seashore before the climactic battle of Issus, and resorted to prayers, invoking Poseidon the sea god, for whom he ordered a four-horse chariot to be cast into the waves. According to Pausanias, Poseidon was one of the caretakers of the oracle at Delphi before Olympian Apollo took it over. Apollo and Poseidon worked closely in many realms, in colonization, for example, Delphic Apollo provided the authorization to go out and settle, while Poseidon watched over the colonists on their way, and provided the lustral water for the foundation sacrifice. Xenophon's Anabasis describes a group of Spartan soldiers in 400-399 BC singing to Poseidon a paean, a kind of hymn normally sung for Apollo. Like Dionysus, who inflamed the Maenads, Poseidon also caused certain forms of mental disturbance. A Hippocratic text of ca. 400 BC, on the sacred disease says that he was blamed for certain types of epilepsy. Topic. Epithets Poseidon was known in various guises, denoted by epithets. In the town of Ag in Euboea, he was known as Poseidon Aegeus and had a magnificent temple upon a hill. Poseidon also had a close association with horses, known under the epithet Poseidon Hippios, usually in Arcadia. He is more often regarded as the tamer of horses, but in some myths he is their father, either by spilling his seed upon a rock or by mating with a creature who then gave birth to the first horse. He was closely related with the springs, and with the strike of his trident, he created springs. Many springs like Hippocrene and Agonipe in Helicon are related with the word horse hippos. Also Glucopi, Hyperipe. In the historical period, Poseidon was often referred to by the epithets Enosithon, Cesithon and Enosygios, and Gaiochos Gaiochos all meaning earth shaker, and referring to his role in causing earthquakes. Some other epithets of Poseidon are Asphalios, Asphalia safety, as protector from the earthquakes. Heliconios. Elikanios related with the mountain Helicon. Tavrios. Torios related with the bull. There was a fest. Tavea. In Ephesos. Petraios. Petraios related with rocks in Thessaly. He hit a rock, and the horse. Skyphios. Appeared. Epoptus. 
Epoptis supervisor in Megalopolis. Pelagios in Ionia. Phycios. Phycios related with seaweeds in Mykonos. Phytalmios. Phytalmios related with the vegetation in Troizen, Megara, Rhodes. Epithets related with the genealogy trees. Patrogenios. Genethlios. Genesios. Pater. Fratrios. Epacteus. Meaning, God worshipped on the coast. In Samos. Topic: Mythology. Topic: Birth. Poseidon was the second son of the Titans Cronus and Rhea. In most accounts, he is swallowed by Cronus at birth and is later saved, along with his other brothers and sisters, by Zeus. However, in some versions of the story, he, like his brother Zeus, did not share the fate of his other brother and sisters who were eaten by Cronus. He was saved by his mother Rhea, who concealed him among a flock of lambs and pretended to have given birth to a colt, which she gave to Cronus to devour. According to John Zetz's The Corotrophus, or nurse of Poseidon was Arne, who denied knowing where he was, when Cronus came searching. According to Diodorus Siculus Poseidon was raised by the Telchines on Rhodes, just as Zeus was raised by the Corabants on Crete. According to a single reference in the Iliad, when the world was divided by Lot in three, Zeus received the sky, Hades the underworld and Poseidon the sea, in Homer's Odyssey, Book 5, Lane. 398, Poseidon has a home in A.G. Topic. Foundation of Athens Athena became the patron goddess of the city of Athens after a competition with Poseidon. Yet Poseidon remained a numinous presence on the Acropolis in the form of his surrogate, Erechtheus. At the dissolution festival at the end of the year in the Athenian calendar, the Skira, the priests of Athena and the priest of Poseidon would process under canopies to Eleusis. They agreed that each would give the Athenians one gift and the Athenians would choose whichever gift they preferred. Poseidon struck the ground with his trident and a spring sprang up, the water was salty and not very useful, whereas Athena offered them an olive tree. The Athenians or their king, Cecrops, accepted the olive tree and along with it Athena as their patron, for the olive tree brought wood, oil and food. After the fight, infuriated at his loss, Poseidon sent a monstrous flood to the Attic Plain, to punish the Athenians for not choosing him. The depression made by Poseidon's trident and filled with salt water was surrounded by the northern hall of the Erechtheum, remaining open to the air. In cult, Poseidon was identified with Erechtheus, Walter Burkert noted. The myth turns this into a temporal causal sequence. In his anger at losing, Poseidon led his son Eumolpus against Athens and killed Erechtheus. The contest of Athena and Poseidon was the subject of the reliefs on the western pediment of the Parthenon, the first sight that greeted the arriving visitor. This myth is construed by Robert Graves and others as reflecting a clash between the inhabitants during Mycenaean times and newer immigrants. Athens at its height was a significant sea power, at one point defeating the Persian fleet at Salamis Island in a sea battle. Topic. Walls of Troy Poseidon and Apollo, having offended Zeus by their rebellion in Hera's scheme, were temporarily stripped of their divine authority and sent to serve King Lamedon of Troy. He had them build huge walls around the city and promised to reward them well, a promise he then refused to fulfill. In vengeance, before the Trojan War, Poseidon sent a sea monster to attack Troy. The monster was later killed by Heracles. Topic. 
Consorts and children Poseidon was said to have had many lovers of both sexes see expandable list below. His consort was Amphitrite, a nymph and ancient sea goddess, daughter of Nerus and Doris. Together they had a son named Triton, a merman. Poseidon was the father of many heroes. He is thought to have fathered the famed Theseus. A mortal woman named Tyro was married to Cretheus with whom she had one son, Aeson, but loved Enipeus, a river god. She pursued Enipeus, who refused her advances. One day, Poseidon, filled with lust for Tyro, disguised himself as Enipeus, and from their union were born the heroes Peleus and Neleus, twin boys. Poseidon also had an affair with Elope, his granddaughter through Circeon, his son and king of Eleusis, begetting the Attic hero Hippothoon. Circeon had his daughter buried alive but Poseidon turned her into the spring, Elope, near Eleusis. Poseidon rescued Amamone from a lecherous satyr and then fathered a child, Nauplius, by her. After having raped Caneus, Poseidon fulfilled her request and changed her into a male warrior. A mortal woman named Clato once lived on an isolated island. Poseidon fell in love with the human mortal and created a dwelling sanctuary at the top of a hill near the middle of the island and surrounded the dwelling with rings of water and land to protect her. She gave birth to five sets of twin boys. The firstborn, Atlas, became the first ruler of Atlantis. Not all of Poseidon's children were human. In an archaic myth, Poseidon once pursued Demeter. She spurned his advances, turning herself into a mare so that she could hide in a herd of horses. He saw through the deception and became a stallion and captured her. Their child was a horse, Arian, which was capable of human speech. Poseidon also raped Medusa on the floor of a temple to Athena. Medusa was then changed into a monster by Athena. When she was later beheaded by the hero Perseus, Chrysor and Pegasus emerged from her neck. His other children include Polyphemus the Cyclops, and, finally, Alebian and Bergeon and Otos and Ephialte the giants. Topic. List of Poseidon's consorts and children Topic. Female lovers and offspring Male lovers Nerites Pelops Patroclus Topic. Genealogy Topic. In literature and art In Greek art, Poseidon rides a chariot that was pulled by a hippocampus or by horses that could ride on the sea. He was associated with dolphins and three-pronged fish spears tridents. He lived in a palace on the ocean floor, made of coral and gems. In the Iliad Poseidon favors the Greeks, and on several occasions takes an active part in the battle against the Trojan forces. However, in Book 20 he rescues Aeneas after the Trojan prince is laid low by Achilles. In the Odyssey, Poseidon is notable for his hatred of Odysseus who blinded the god's son, the Cyclops Polyphemus. The enmity of Poseidon prevents Odysseus's return home to Ithaca for many years. Odysseus is even told, notwithstanding his ultimate safe return, that to placate the wrath of Poseidon will require one more voyage on his part. In the Aeneid, Neptune is still resentful of the wandering Trojans, but is not as vindictive as Juno, and in Book I he rescues the Trojan fleet from the goddesses' attempts to wreck it, although his primary motivation for doing this is his annoyance at Juno's having intruded into his domain. A hymn to Poseidon included among the Homeric hymns is a brief invocation, a seven-line introduction that addresses the god as both 
mover of the earth and barren sea, god of the deep who is also lord of Helicon and wide Ag, and specifies his twofold nature as an Olympian. A tamer of horses and a savior of ships, Poseidon appears in Percy Jackson and the Olympians as the father of Percy Jackson and Tyson the Cyclops. He also appears in the ABC television series Once Upon a Time as the guest star of the second half of season 4 played by Ernie Hudson. In this version, Poseidon is portrayed as the father of the sea witch Ursula. Topic narrations Poseidon myths as told by storytellers Bibliography of Reconstruction, Homer, Odyssey, 11.567 7th century BC Pindar, Olympian Odes, 1 476 BC Euripides, Orestes, 12-16 408 BC Bibliotheca Epitome 2-1-9 140 BC Ovid, Metamorphoses, v. 213, 458 AD 8, Hyginus, Fables, 82, Tantalus, 83, Pelops, 1st century AD, Pausanias, Description of Greece, 2.22.3 AD 160-176, Bibliography of Reconstruction, Pindar, Olympian Ode, I, 476 BC, Sophocles, 1, Electra, 504, 430-415 BC, and 2, Enemaeus, Fr, 4 433-408 BC Euripides, Orestes, 1024-1062 408 BC Bibliotheca Epitome 2, 1-9 140 BC Diodorus Siculus, Histories, 4.73 1st century BC Hyginus, Fables, 84 Oinomaeus, Poetic Astronomy, e 1st century AD Pausanias, Description of Greece, 5.1.37, 5. 13.1, 6.21.9, 8.14.10211, c. AD 160-176, Philostratus the Elder Imagines, I.30, Pelops, AD 170-245, Philostratus the Younger, Imagines, 9, Pelops, c. 200-245, First Vatican Mythographer, 22, Myrtilus, Atreus et Thyestes Second Vatican Mythographer, 146, Enemaeus Gallery Paintings <gallery> 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 Topic Statues Topic See also Atlantis Ionian League Paneonium Ionian Festival to Poseidon Odyssey Trident of Poseidon Equals equals explanatory notes <laughs>